Apple's iPhone 5 is already sold out in most stores. Apple claims its latest phone is its most powerful to date, and it also boasts a larger screen than any of the previous versions. It's been about a year since the iPhone 4S came out, and that was a phone that UBM Tech Insights estimated to cost Apple about $203 to manufacture. UBM Tech Insights took a look at the guts powering the iPhone 5 and discovered that it's actually costing Apple a lot less to manufacture than the iPhone 4S, despite having some more expensive components. The A6 processor powering the iPhone 5 costs about $33.20 while the A5 inside the 4S cost $26 when it came out last year. While the 4S had a dual-band radio that could operate on any network, Apple has gone back to manufacturing two separate phones for CDMA and GSM networks. Most likely, they did that to include the newer 4G capability that the iPhone 5 now has. The cell radio inside now costs just under $28, while the dual-band radio in the 4S cost $24. The price of the camera hasn't changed much. While both phones feature an 8 megapixel camera, Apple says the iPhone 5 comes with a much more advanced lens. The price of the camera on the iPhone 5 is $17, down $1 from the $18 it costs on the iPhone 4S. The other components of the phone, the display, battery, RAM, casing, and other materials, all add up to $102. That's down quite a bit from the $135 they cost on the iPhone 4S. Because of this, the iPhone 5 has a total materials cost of just over $180. That's down more than $20 from what the iPhone 4S cost. Now, Apple sells these phones to carriers for almost $600, so it looks like they've managed to make their profit on the iPhone 5 even bigger.